here at the Bulletproof Tent at the Killington World Cup, and I'm here with some athletes from the U.S. Ski and Snowboard team, and we're gonna have a quick conversation about what it means to be Bulletproof. I'm AJ Hearn. I'm Abby Jewett. I'm Alice Merriweather. So, what are some things that you personally either like do as a pre-training ritual just to stay focused, or just like, what do you do to just, you know, get over those jitters and just kind of focus on where you're at and keeping yourself at peak performance? I mean, it changes a lot, but definitely listening to music and just like talking to one another, I feel like kind of is good for nerves and get rid of <laughs> I kind of have like some routines I do that um, get my body ready and stuff and that like helps me feel prepared, which like puts my mind at ease, so I like that, but definitely talking to your teammates. I think yesterday there was no getting over the nerves for me, <laughs> but having these guys here helps. Keeping it really casual and not not getting stressed out about the environment of, of a World Cup is, is key to staying calm. Um, and I also, I do a very strict warm-up routine where I do the same thing, whether it's training, I'm working out, it's always the same warm-up and that just kind of refocuses myself and my brain and gets me ready to go. So post-training, either, you know, in terms of like helping your body recover or just kind of helping your mind recover, what are some like of your go-to hacks? Take a nap. <laughs> <laughs> Lie down in bed for a while. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah we definitely do dry land in the afternoons to um, help our bodies recover. Um, I don't know, my teammates are definitely a big part of that if you have a bad day or a good day. They're just awesome to be around. I like to unwind with a little music. I travel with a ukulele and one of my teammates travels with her guitar. And so after a stressful day of training or racing, we'll go back and just play music and sing and, and have a good time. Um, is there anything else that you'd want to share with someone who is, you know, maybe they're watching this race for the first time and just feeling like just super excited and motivated by like all of your hard work? Is there anything that you would want to say about just your experience as a skier representing your country? I mean, I definitely feel so lucky to be here representing the U.S. in the U.S. Yeah. I feel like that's a really awesome experience and I think we all feel so lucky. <laughs> yeah, I guess kind of what we said before, just work hard and believe in yourself. I mean, we're here because the fans are here and the fans are following us, and so, I mean, thanks to everyone that's supporting us, because we, we literally would not be here without everyone. This has been Rebecca. We're here at the Killington World Cup waiting for the second run of the day for the slalom event, and it's a beautiful day to be bulletproof. Thanks.